together every day, having adventures as we play. Up in the hills, down on the beach, always a rainbow within reach. On Animal Island, on Animal Island, yeah. On Animal Island, on Animal Island, come on. Hello. To say hello, hello, hello. Let's stop to say hello. It's a way to say we're glad you're here. Come on and say hello. Hello, hedgehog. Hello, fox. Hello, pig. Hello, monkey. When friends are near, we smile and say hello. When friends are far. We wave and say hello. It's a friendly word that shows we care. Come on and say hello. Hello, Mr. Frog. Hello. Hello, hello Mr. Mr. Goose. Goose. Hello. Hello, friend. Hello. 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 Hi. Nice to see you. <laughs> I spy shapes everywhere Circles, triangles, ovals, squares Stars, rectangles, so many kinds See how many we can find Hello, friend. It's so good to see you. You're just in time. I was about to check the mail. I'm expecting a letter from Ms. Panda. Let's check the mail together. Are you coming? Look, there's a letter in our mailbox. It's addressed to Mr. Goose, the Treehouse, Animal Island. That means it's for me. Could it be from Ms. Panda? It is from Ms. Panda. I'll open it. There is a letter and some pictures inside. I'll read the letter out loud. Hello, everyone. I'm visiting my friend. Everywhere I go, I see shapes. I've sent you some photos. Ooh, let's look. What shape do you see in the first picture? Hmm, do you see it? Oh! oh. Well done. What shape do you see in the second picture? Oh, I think I see it. Oval! Fantastic! What shape do you see in the last picture? Hmm, what shape do you see? Oval! Yes. Can you find shapes on Animal Island? Love, Ms. Panda. That's a great idea. We'll make oval our special shape of the day. Let's look for ovals on Animal Island. Let's look for ovals. Do you see one? Let's look for another one. Let's look for one more. Do you see it? There it is. We did it! <laughs> Yay! See you! I know a game we can play. Let's try to find three things shaped like ovals. Like this. I see one. That's right! Let's look for another one. Do you see one? Awesome! Let's look for one more. Hi, monkey! Wanna look for ovals together? 
Let's head to Mr. Frog's pond. Okay! Look for three things shaped like ovals. That's right! Let's look for another one. Do you see one? Awesome! Let's look for one more. <laughs> Thanks for playing! Goodbye! Shapes Circles Triangles Ovals Squares Stars Rectangles Hey, I have an idea! Look! Hello, everyone. It's story time. Yay! Gather round, everyone. What book are we reading? We're reading this one. It's called Zanel Sees Numbers. Let's find out what happens. Let's begin. Zanel Sees Numbers. Written by Laura Delange, illustrated by Henry Coetzee, designed by Arthur Atwell. Everyone tells Zanel that numbers are all around her, but no matter how hard she tries, she can't see them. Zanel asks Grandmother to help her see some numbers. Grandmother points to the jars on the shelf and counts one, two, three, Four. But Zanel is unhappy. Those aren't numbers. Those are jars. Zanel asks Mom to help her see some numbers. Mom points to the carrots in the garden and counts one, two, three, four. But Zanel is unhappy. Those aren't numbers. Those are carrots. Zanel sees Linda counting the chickens to see if they have all come back home. One, two, three, four. But Zanel is unhappy. Those aren't numbers. Those are chickens. Zanel sees Auntie counting the hours until dinner. One. Two, three, four. But Zanel is unhappy. Those aren't numbers. Those are hours. Zanel can't see the numbers in the world. She goes to speak to her sister, who is eight years old and knows everything. If you look at anything in the right way, you can see a number in it, her sister says. She gives Zanel a pair of magic glasses and tells her to go look for numbers in the world. One, two, three, four. The end. Thank you, Mr. Goose. Thank you for reading with me. Kids, it's time for a sing-along with Mr. Frog. Yay! Remember to say hello when you see him. Hello, kids. Hello, Mr. Frog. Today's song is about a dog called Bingo. I'll sing the first verse, then you sing along with me, okay? There was a farmer had a dog and Bingo was his name, oh, B-I-N. 
I N G O B I N G O and Bingo was his name. Oh, now you'll all sing along with me, but this time we'll replace the first letter of Bingo's name with a hand clap. I don't understand. That's okay. Just follow along. Everybody sing. There was a farmer had a dog and Bingo was his name. Oh. I-N-G-O, 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 and Bingo was his name Oh, That was fun! Good! Now replace the first two letters with hand claps. Everybody sing! There was a farmer had a dog and Bingo was his name Oh, N-G-O, 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 and Bingo was his name Oh. Now, three hand claps. Here we go. There was a farmer had a dog and Bingo was his name Geo, oh. Geo, 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 and Bingo was his name Oh, Splendid! Let's do four hand claps. There was a farmer had a dog and Bingo was his name Oh, Oh, Oh. Oh, and Bingo was his name, oh. Last verse. Everybody sing and clap. There was a farmer had a dog, and Bingo was his name, oh. And Bingo was his name, oh. You did it! Yay! <laughs> Thank you for singing with me. Goodbye! Thank you, Mr. Rob! Here's something we already did. Let's do it again. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Goose, can we trace a letter? Absolutely. Let's practice making the letter X. Who can think of a fun way to do it? Ooh, ooh, I know. Let's trace letters on the dirt using the watering can. Well, that sounds like a great idea. Pig, why don't you go first? Yeah! X! Great! I'll try next! <laughs> Terrific tracing! Now, let's trace the lowercase letter. I want to try! <laughs> X! Ooh. Nice job! Let's look at the letters we made. What's this letter? X! Exactly! Uppercase X. And what's this letter? X! That's right! Lowercase X. Nice job! Wow! Wow! Cool! Nice work, everybody! Thank you, Mr. Goose! X! Hey, everybody! Let's practice our letters by playing the alphabet game! Yay! I want to hear you, too! Let's all play the alphabet game When I show you a letter, say its name Are you ready? Yeah! What's this letter? What's this letter? X! What's this letter? H! What's this letter? K! Now let's do it fast! H A X K X A H K H X K A H K X A! Nice work, everyone! 
everybody. That's how you play the alphabet game when you see a letter. You say its name. Woo! The letter A. <laughs> Monkey. It's time to say goodbye. Let's sing our goodbye song. Goodbye, goodbye. It's time to say goodbye. Goodbye, goodbye. Let's stop to say goodbye before we say hello again. We need to say goodbye. Goodbye, friend. Goodbye. goodbye. <laughs> Time to rest. Take a deep breath in. Let it out. Good. Listen. Do you know? The Muffin Man, the Muffin Man, the Muffin Man. Do you know the Muffin Man who lives on Drury Lane? Oh yes, I know the Muffin Man, the Muffin Man, the Muffin Man. Yes, I know the Muffin Man who lives on Drury Lane. Do the Muffin Man, the Muffin Man, the Muffin Man. Do you know the Muffin Man who lives on Drury Lane? Oh yes, I know the Muffin Man, the Muffin Man, the Muffin Man. Yes, I know the Muffin Man 